Hey guys, how are you doing today? Happy Mother's Day to all the mamas out there and for the people like me that have the um, fur babies. Happy Mama's Day to all the fur baby people. Um, so the Lord spoke to me last night and gave me a message. Um, he finished it this morning. So I am actually at church with the family right now. We do like a family Bible study at the house and um, I call it my church <laughs> now. <clears throat> anyway, so I stepped outside since we're done. But I claim that Jesus Christ is the Son of God. He's also God. He came to earth as a man in the flesh. He bled on the cross for our sins and died for us. And he rose on the third day. Ignore the telegram and the WhatsApp people on YouTube because they're trying to scam you. Okay, so message for May 13th, 2023. Um, Revelation 6.14. Um, most of the message was done, well, about half and half. So he likes to do it in two day increments. It's kind of crazy because he always gives it to me at night. But Revelation 614. Then the sky receded as a scroll when it is rolled up and every mountain and island was moved out of its place. Second Thessalonians 2.5. Do you not remember that when I was still with you, I told you these things? First Peter 2.9. But you are a chosen generation, a royal priesthood, a holy nation, his own special people, that you may proclaim the praises of him who called you out of darkness into his marvelous light. Judges 5.8. They chose new gods, then there was war in the gates, not a shield or spear was seen among 40,000 in Israel. Esther 1.11. To bring Queen Vashti before the king wearing her royal crown in order to show her beauty to the people and the officials, for she was beautiful to behold. Uh, Ruth 4.2. And he took 10 men of the elders of the city and said, sit down here. So they sat down. Uh, Joel 3, 6. Also the people of Judah and people of Jerusalem who have sold to the Greeks, that you may remove them far from their borders. 1 Corinthians 4, 8. You are already full. You are already rich. You have reigned as kings without us. And indeed, I could wish you did reign, that we also might reign with you. 1 John 1, 1 through 2. That which was from the beginning, which we have heard, which we have seen with our eyes, which we have looked upon, and our hands have handled concerning the word of life, the life was manifested, and we have seen and bear witness and declare to you that eternal life, which was the Father and was manifested to us. Okay, and then John 1.12. But as many as received him to them, he gave the right to become children of God to those who believe in his name. Okay, and so here's the message. My child, the resurrection is the key to the rapture. Look at the 43rd day. I want all my children to know I am coming for them. Take heed to these warnings. I told you to look at the first Passover. The ones who are truly seeking me with all of their hearts, I will reveal the day to you. Keep looking up time is so short not everyone will understand my true calendar but i told you passover and purim is here and this is my countdown remember the beginning is also the end so do not forget to reverse my judgment my seals of wrath seven is the key it starts it all unfortunately not everyone is invited to the wedding feast your hearts are cold your faith is weak and your belief in me is non-existent you speak about me with your mouth but your heart is far away from the truth Remember, I know everyone's heart. I know everyone's thought. Why are you still scoffing at your neighbor? Your pride won't let you forgive. How can you love me, one you have never seen, but hate your brother who you have seen? You can never please me without faith. The key of David is faith and belief in me. You come to me with repentance and believe in me with your heart and confess I am Lord with your mouth and I will save you. I love you, child. I don't wish for anyone to perish, even the wicked I wish to redeem. If they would just believe in me, pick up my cross and follow me, I will save them also. There is nothing you can do to keep me from loving you. My Father sent me to save the world, not condemn it. There is no condemnation in Christ Jesus. So why are you relying on your works to get you to heaven? My arms are open and stretch far and wide calling you home. I am the good shepherd and my sheep hear my voice. I am calling them home. Are you being guided by the Holy Spirit or are you leaning on your own understanding of scripture? 
why are you seeking earthly things when I told you to seek heavenly things? Some of you are being deceived. You listen to false teachers who do not share my true gospel. This false teaching spreads like yeast throughout the churches. It must be rebuked and casted off. It's leading people down the wrong path. You do not want to be held accountable for leading new believers astray. You must seek for guidance and truth. Did I call you to speak your false teachings? Did I put my words in your mouth? The people I call to speak my good news will be hated among the nations, just as they hated me. But look at their fruits. They still love you just as I love you. Children, I'm trying to wake you up from what's coming. Do you even know what is behind this darkness coming? Black death covers the darkness. Satellite 512 is the opening to it. Death Rider and the plague, it's all coming. My spirit won't be there to guide you. It's removed when I take my children and chosen ones. Remember, I told you it's the end, but it's only the beginning. There's meaning behind that message. Everything I say means something. Has black death happened before? Has darkness happened before? I speak in riddles and parables. Who have ears to hear, let them hear. Who have eyes to see, let them see. It's all coming and I'm the only one who can save you. Perfect love casts out all fear. There is nothing to fear when you walk in my spirit. I will bring you an undeniable peace and your heart will grow to love. Stop mocking your neighbor. I told you to love them. Get the log out of your eye before you look at the speck in your neighbor's eye. Did I call you to judge them? There is only one judge you speak to your brother and sisters with love and correction. Animosity, hate, jealousy, irate, it's all misguided fruits from the devil. Don't follow the devil. He leads you to a path of destruction. He leads you to eternal hell, fire and brimstone. Why do you worship someone who has never loved you? Why do you bow down to bow when he destroys your life? If you lay down your idols and pick up your, cr your cross and follow me, I will give you eternal life. Come to me with childlike faith and believe in me and I will save you. You must believe like a child to enter my kingdom. A child who believes without seeing is blessed. I love you children, wake up and count the days I am at the door. Your Abba, your friend, your deliverer, your rescuer, your Lord God and I have spoken. And he gave me Jeremiah 110. See, I have this day set over the nations and over the kingdoms to root out and to pull down, to destroy and to throw down, to build and to plant. Job 7, 3. So I have been allotted months of futility and wearisome nights have been appointed to me. Exodus 2, 14. Then he said, who made you a prince and judge over us? Do you intend to kill me as you killed the Egyptian? So Moses feared and said, surely this thing is known. First Chronicles 8, 9. By Hodesh, his wife, he begot Jobab, Zibiah, Mishal, and Malcam. <clears throat> Revelation 6, 6. And I heard a voice in the midst of the four living creatures saying, a quart of wheat for a denarius and three quarts of barley for a denarius and do not harm the oil and the wine. Seals are about to be opened. I'm calling you up. Redemption draws nigh. Look up, I love you. First Kings 21, three, but Naboth said to Ahab, the Lord forbid that I should give the inheritance of my fathers to you. Amos 2, nine, yet it was I who destroyed the Amorite before them, whose height was like the height of the cedars and he was as strong as the oaks. Yet I destroyed his fruit above and his roots beneath. Matthew 17, 11, Jesus answered and said to them, indeed, Elijah is coming first and will restore all things. Revelation 8, 9, and a third of the living creatures in the sea died and a third of the ships were destroyed. First Peter 4, 8, and above all things have fervent love for one another for love will cover a multitude of sins. John 3, 11, most assuredly I say to you, we speak what we know and testify what we have seen and you do not receive our witness. Okay guys, so that was the whole message. Believe in Jesus with all your heart and he will save you. <clears throat> I will tell you, I just read a comment right before church today and um, he had already given me the message. I left home, I already had it printed out and there was someone that commented that said, um, he doesn't speak in riddles, he speaks in parables. Well, apparently Jesus heard that comment because he gave me this message early this morning around seven something in the morning from finishing it from last night, okay? And this comment was posted after that and I had just read it and commented on it. So Jesus listens to the comments. So guys, he knows everyone's heart. He knows everyone's thought. So seek him. He loves everybody. He doesn't want anyone to perish. It's your faith and his grace. God bless you guys.
and happy Mother's Day.